Alan Ball with AVR News. How many of you out there would like to see a Ford Raptor in your driveway for less than $85,000, $90,000 or $100,000? I know I sure would. Well, this could be an option with Ford's new Ranger Raptor. Ford just unveiled the baby Raptor in Bangkok, Thailand in early February. Now, like its big brother, this Raptor will feature high quality suspension in the form of internal bypass Fox shocks and of course, larger off-road tires. The other Raptor DNA is coming in the form of a unique frame design, which is intended to support the high quality suspension components in very rough terrain. The overseas version will be debuted with a bio-turbocharged two liter diesel engine. Now Ford claims this diesel will produce 210 horsepower and a mighty 369 foot-pounds of torque. There's a 10-speed automatic transmission that is tasked to handle all that torque. Now Ford hasn't made any mention if this bad boy is coming to the United States. If Ford does sell this truck in the United States, and I hope they do, I wouldn't be surprised if they throw in one of Ford's torquey EcoBoost gas motors. We'll keep you updated as we learn more on the Ranger Raptor. Now onto an AVR news update. As many of you know, Project Power Wagon is in full swing with the latest install being from Midland MXT 115 GMRS radio. Make sure to click the link below so you don't miss out on this very informative review. But what's next for Project Power Wagon? This big badass slotted rotor which was sent to us from buybrakes.com. Now this rotor is just one of four which will of course be installed on the wagon to obviously help with the braking efficiency in all driving conditions. So make sure to subscribe to get the latest information with Project Power Wagon and other AVR content. That's all the news we got for you this time. Make sure to crush that like button and subscribe. Thanks for joining us on what is episode one of AVR News. And remember, be safe, go prepared, and get there. We'll see you next time.